Students here at Bynum School may have unique learning challenges, but through nematherapy, they're able to make beautiful paintings like this one. Paintbrushes, paints, paper were all on the list of supplies needed for today's nematherapy lesson. Evan and Angie are just two of the students at Bynum who not only enjoy, but learn from these special activities. Pictures? What kind of pictures? Um, a blue butterfly. Megan Miller uses nematherapy to connect the right and left brain. Row, row your boat gently down the stream. They sing songs and do hand movements to help with coordination. Cross lateral physical movements, bilateral eye movements. We're incorporating a lot of things into a small amount of time that use the whole brain. Songs, hand games, even painting. They're all activities used to teach the value of finishing what you begin. This is fun, and not to mention the confidence that it builds, you know, for these kids to be able to be so successful at something like art, which can be very intimidating. Bynum School Development Director Tracy Bush says they're lucky to have Miller since she's the only licensed nematherapist in the entire state. During my time here, I've been able to see the process and see the thought that goes into each brush stroke. Miller says that her feedback has been that when students leave this class, they're calmer and more focused in their next classes. In Midland, Sarah Strackhouse, CBS 7 News.